Hello everyone, once again, this is Slesha. Game number two. Going to start, I think, relatively soon. Searching for our game right now. As you can see, I just lost, or if you have seen it, I've lost just one game in gold. And I'm still trying to improve. I'm still working on my hotkeys. And to be quite fair, I think I had the upper hand in the last game, but uh, due to the lack of scouting, maybe with an observer, I was not able to see the double um, stargate from the enemy, and I got crushed by voids. So, this time I'm facing against the Zerg player. So I'll open up with the Forge Fast expand. I'm not too familiar with the uh, gateway, first, uh, gateway expand, that is. So I'll try to... Uh, I th I think I might try to uh, bust him with an immortal all in if he's not going for anything uh, cheeky, that is. My good god, I already screwed up a little bit. I'll get for a scout immediately after the pylon, just to see if he's going for uh, shenanigans like a six pool. If he is, I think literally hope that I'm able to, to get uh, a cannon on my main base after I start the forge. If he isn't, then I'll try to uh, expand first. And I'm getting some weird lag spikes at the moment, not quite sure why that is, but that's just how it is. Can't see a pool just yet. Kind of pool, so I'll open up with the with the nexus first, and I'll, I think I will scout afterwards once again with the uh, prop that is building the uh, nexus in just a little bit. Why do I do that? Because I want to confirm whether or not he's going for false expand, or if he might try something uh, cheeky like going for double expand and. Just get the economical uh, echo lead on me, like severely, which would obviously not uh, be a good thing for me to happen. So up next, the forge. Okay. And add one more pylon. Can see that I went for an uh, expand first. So let's see, there is this expansion. Add one gateway at the front, and this will be lo the location where I will build my cannon. This pool is not yet done, so I think I might get away with that. Start the forge, uh, the cannon, that is. And get one more gas guys going as soon as possible. There we go. And as soon as the gas is done, I think my uh, should be able to build myself a lot of cybernetics core. Get two into the first gas geyser, two into the second gas geyser. Zealot obviously necessary for uh, defense in the early game. Still have a probe in the space, which is a little bit intriguing at the moment. No, just going to lose it right now. Yep, there I lost it. So I'll add one more into each gas geyser. Continue to work on my pro production and get my uh, role of facility, uh, robotic facility. There it is, and one sentry, and start the uh, warp gate research. And I'll get one more gas, guys, on my third, on my second, my expansion. 
So now it's time to add additional gateways in my main. I think I should go for uh, 6 or 7. I think 6 should be actually enough. While I probe behind that. And get the mothership core as well. I wish I could do something about the leg spikes, I don't know why I get them. Something that I've learned in the past is that it's actually a good idea to get one uh, observer. Because if the enemy has tunneling claws, um, I won't be able to detect it. I'll go for plus one because um, with plus one I should be able to. Um, I think it's two shotting the. Uh, I've only six gateways right now, so I'll add one more. And now he's spot spotted it. As soon as I have uh, two immortals, I should move out, and I'll try to take up behind the two uh, colossi. So I'll get one more gas. Guys, I already saw the second gas on my natural. That is, and I'm supplied not severely. So the push will come, even though it will be a little bit weaker than uh, I hoped for. And try to deny, deny his expansion that is on his main. Uh, This one just finished, so add three more into the uh, gas geyser. Yeah. That's not what I wanted to happen. But the leg spikes obviously do not help me at the moment. And he expanded. Base is under attack. Get another mothership, mothership core. And I think I'll add the... Uh, Twilight uh, Council as well. I'll try to get my second Colossi and the external thermal at the same time. And yeah, I have the forge so get the plus one armor as well. And I'll try to expand behind that now. Because obviously the first push that did not work, and his speed for his uh, overloads. Get one more, get one more, get one more. 
There we go. He obviously has the upper hand in the in the tech, so I'll maybe even try to get one additional expansion. Start charge first. And if the external thermal is just finished, I'll try to uh, get another expansion and get one. to attack and I'll start my uh, Templars archive behind that. I obviously need more gas so I'll fill up the gas cases immediately. So I'll stop the uh, production of Colossi, Kid Storm, and at High Templars. And I'll add a couple more gateways as well. I'll add a couple of immortals now into the mix. And uh, did I get blink? No, hey, I did get blink, but not charge. Actually, I wanted to go for charge first. There he is. That's a real shame. Why did he pull back? I guess just because he... Uh, they were given. the lag spikes would stop. This is not playable. And it's GG. GG. And well fact. And surrender. That was game number two. I don't know if you can see it on the uh, 
screen it just a little bit or later on and if you watch it on YouTube. But the delay was so horrible. Anyways, cheers everyone. Bye bye.